Hey everybody, I'm Gary Grafe out here at Special Equestrians taking our once every six weeks farrier day trimming and chewing the horses for the program. This is Daisy I'm working on and we just got done cleaning out her sole and frogs, frog area. Now we're going to trim the hoof wall. Start out using the, the hoof nippers. I'll follow up with the rasp. And when I'm done with that, we're going to outline some of the more dominant features of the hoof. Let everybody see what a freshly cleaned, trimmed foot looks like and some of the structures that make it work. Now we're going to smooth it all out with the rasp. Check to see we have a nice flat surface for Daisy to walk on. Make sure we remove any high spots. Remove any areas that we might have some sole pressure. Okay, I'm going to mark the white line or the lamin, which is the structure that holds the hoof wall on the outside to all of the live structure inside. The area outside of the purple line is the hoof wall. Again, the purple line outlines the lamin or the white line. The area inside, white with a little bit of a yellowish tint is the sole. The frog is, is this structure. Use a little different color here. The bars help reinforce the hoof wall. They're right here. We have an area right in this area that if there's too much pressure left from the horse landing on it, they'll develop corns. So we call that the seat of the corn. It's pretty uh, unique structure there. That's pretty much the, what a trimmed hoof looks like. Now I'll get the shoe prepared and uh, get it ready to nail back on. Thanks Gary. You're welcome.